hello today i'm here with a new video and if you don't know who i am my name is lisa i'm a cruelty youtuber that does a lot of makeup content and today it is the third part in my novla cutie week and if you don't know what that is i can leave my first part up here but also i'm using all the seven cutie palettes this is so hard for me all the cutie palettes from novla this week and because it's day number three it is time for the third palette and this is platinum and I really love this it's a small grungy cool palette and the shimmers in this is amazing so I'm going to do a look today and I know exactly what I want to do I have already picked out the lipstick that I'm going to use to this look so I think we just hop into this and I realized I said wrong things in my first video I yeah, it must have been first. I said that this came out together with Nude and Coral. It did not. This came together with Metropolitan and Wildberry. So, sorry about that. And I have cat hair on my lips. Okay, let's get started. And I think I've been most excited about this palette. So... I'm just going to start. I'm going to start with Aristocracy. 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 I'm going to start with this one in my crease. And I think I might deepen it down with this one. And then on my lid, I'm going in with gold. And I know that I have only like silver jewelry on. Do you know what? Nobody cares. Maybe somebody do, but I do not. So I'm going to start with this one in my crease, and this is kind of dark. So maybe I don't need to deepen this down. Do you see this? So I don't know why I love this palette so much, because it's not like the typical colors that I use. Maybe a little bit more now, but this is always a, a special place in my heart. And I don't really know why because this is maybe it's getting a little bit more me but it's not like the typical me i don't know it is just such a nice palette and i'm going in with the same shade and i want to take it the whole way but i don't want it to dark in here so i'm really tapping it off i don't feel like i need to deepen this down because this is pretty dark so i will go in with the same shade out here and then i will take the gold one so yeah i'm doing a half cut crease again nobody is surprised so i'm going to take this one and i think i'm going to uh, between the matte shade and the gold one i think i will go in with rich darling we will see and now i'm going in with the matte and this is just this is such an amazing shade And do you see like how pigmented this is? I I don't think I need it anymore, <laughs> but going in with a little bit more. Okay, I'm going to take Priceless on the rest of my lid. And I will start with this and I guess it will go together with the matte shade. But I still feel that I want to take the shimmer that looks like the matte shade or has the same tone. This one to just connect them a little bit. Taking this up in my crease. Just the angle, okay? I have a big mirror right underneath you, but I'm still holding the palette and looking like this. I don't know. Okay, so I will leave it like this. I will just slap this on on the other eye and then I go in with the other shimmer shade. So I'm just going into my color swift thing. I actually bought a new one that I've had for a couple of years and it's getting so... I've tried to clean it but... 
I guess they are worn out after a while. So now I will go in with the same brush with Rich Darling. Just to blend this together. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's make it a smooth transition from the gold to the matte one, but I'm also going in with the matte one on this shimmer. And then I'm going back in a little bit with the shimmer. So I think this is everything I want to do to the lids. I will do the rest of my makeup and I'm thinking about taking this one in my inner corners. Even though that this is a silver and I have gold. I will fix my base, my brows, everything and put on a lipstick and I will see during that time if I want to take the silver. You will see that in a sec. Is anybody surprised about my lipstick choice? I guess not. So my waterline I took Wildcat from Colourpop. I, I love this color. It is just amazing and on my lips I took Unspoken from Nabla. And I have catter in my freaking nose. Sometimes it feels like it's stuck into my septum ring and it's just annoying the crap out of me. So yeah, I love this look. I love it so so much. It's dark, it's grungy, it's such a cool look and I really really love it. It is kind of a big difference from the look I did with the coral palette and I love this so much and I love the lipstick to it. I just love everything about this look. And for my inner corners I actually did go in with the, the ozone highlighter from Nabla. It doesn't show that much, but it's a little bit of something. So for this look I have used three colors. So these two and the gold one and amazing. An amazing look, an amazing palette. I still love it super super much. So tomorrow it is time for the Metropolitan number four. And this is one of the palettes I don't like that much. It is just, I don't know with this color, so I don't know what to do. But I guess it might be something dark tomorrow. Or something really light. But yeah, I really hope that you like this video. And I hope that you are looking forward to the rest of the week. We are soon halfway through. And... Uh, I love this lipstick. This is one of my favorite lipsticks from Nabla as well. But okay, I'm going to stop talking now and yeah, I hope you liked this video and I hope I'll see you tomorrow again. Bye!